<sighs> okay, let me get ready to go. Well, wait, wait, mama. Did you cook some food? You ate already. Oh, um, did, did, did you, uh, wash your toes? <laughs> what? Coco, I have to hurry up and go get ready, please. Not right now. Uh, well, where are you going? I have some errands I need to run. I told you about this. And I have to get it done before six. Oh, well, can we play a game? Yes, let's play. Let me go get dressed. Oh, that means that I can dress you? No, that means this conversation needs to end so I can hurry up and go get dressed. Oh, well, you had promised that we could play a game. Well, I don't recall ever saying that. Oh, you don't. January 13 at 2.37 p.m. Mama, can we play a game? Um, yeah, Coco, we will. Just not today, eventually. Oh, I guess I did say that. But I didn't mean right now while I'm trying to head out, Coco. This is not the right time. Coco sat face activated. Stop, just stop. We will play a game another day. Right now, I have to go. Uh, fine, I don't care, it's fine. Nobody ever wants to play with me. You had those old children had me last and now it's a big gap and I had to play by myself. I don't care. I'm ready. Oh. You look okay. I guess I'll take that as a compliment. Yep, uh, you even look okay enough to play a game. No, I don't. I have to go. Well, when is going to be the right time? Because last week you told me this week, and now this week you're telling me it's not the right time. So when's the right time, Mama? Soon. All right, where are my keys? No, I put them right here. Cold. Cold. Cold, cold. What? Are you playing a game? No, I was just trying to help. So you know where my keys are? Possibly. Coco, I don't have time for this. I have to go. Hot. Give me my keys. Caliente, 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 mama. Caliente. If you don't give me my keys now, kiss riding your bike goodbye. Well, well I never rode that bike because I can't really reach the pedals. Give me my keys. I never even said I had your keys. I just said I was colder than I was hot. What is happening? Well, why are you doing all of that? Because I just wanted to play a game. But did you check your pockets? Of course I did. My apologies, Coco. I didn't even know they were there. It's okay, Mama. I understand. You know, it's like sometimes they're there and sometimes they're not. <laughs> Yeah. All right. I'll be back. What the? It looks like you lost it again. Voila. <laughs> Cold. Now, now, Coco. You know that's a no-no. Every time we turn our heads, you're always into trouble. We're pretty big. Summer break has officially begun. What's the plan? Mama, I planned this out for so long. So long. I said as soon as summer break started, I was going to know exactly what I was going to do. Now I have nothing. I can't even find the list that I planned and wrote out everything. Well, I'm sure you'll come up with a lot more, ma'am. You have plenty of time to put a new list together. A, a, a new list? It, it took me almost six months to come up with the old list. It, summer will almost be over by the time I come up with the new list. And then it'll be almost time for the next summer. Okay, calm down, ma'am. Calm down. Okay, while you think of some new ideas, I do have a cute little surprise for you. You, you did it. Oh, oh, O-M-G. But, Mama, you did, O-M-G, O-L-G, you did it! I did? <gasps> Mama, you the mama! You the mama! Well, I'm so happy you're excited about the surprise. What should I name him? <gasps> Maybe Leo? No. Cupcake. Oh, that's not it. Juju. Wait, Mama, is it a boy or a girl? <gasps> oh, oh, I know, I know. I'm going to name it D.O.G. Oh, my goodness, Mama. Thank you, thank you so, so much. Thank you. I'm going to love D.O.G. forever and ever. Oh, okay, wait, calm down. No one said anything about a puppy. I said I have a surprise for you. Yes, a little cute one. 
What else could that be besides a puppy? A lot of things, Coco. And I'm sure you'll be happy to see this too. Look, I'm sorry to disappoint you, but as I told you before, no puppy is coming here until you learn some responsibility, ma'am. Oh, okay. Well, get ready for your surprise because it sounds like it's here. Well, thank you, Mama. Even though it's not a puppy, it must be something that's breathing if it can walk through the door. Yep, and you can play with it too, which would be a great way to start your summer. Coming! Hi, Mrs. Tweety. Tweety! Hi, Coco. How did you get here? You live so far. I thought you were never coming back. Well, my mom, my dad, and I took a plane here to visit my grandma. We'll only be here for a few days, though. Oh, Trent, we have so much we have to do. Oh, I even saw you grew an inch. I did? No, sorry. I just wanted to make you feel good. But what shall we do first? Ooh, how about we do... Um... Okay, well, you all have fun. Coco, don't get out of hand. Be fair and don't be too loud. Okay, I'll make sure he does it, Mama. Coco, I said you. Make sure you don't do any of those things. Okay. Coco, remember what I said. Okay, so what's for us? You want to see my pet? Sure. When I come to your house one day, I could definitely see it. Oh, no. I brought him with me. Really? Mm-hmm. His name is Splat. He's really friendly. Wow. I wish my mama would get me a puppy. I've been waiting forever. I bet yours is so cute. Wait, how'd you sneak a puppy in here? He must be extra tiny. Oh, well, he's actually not a puppy. And he's a little scared, so don't scream. My, Trent, you're walking around here with an alligator? He's not an alligator. He's a lizard. Oh, well... He's for sure not a puppy. I guess he's kind of cute. Can I hold him? Yeah, sure. Splat, Coco, Coco, Splat. Well, be gentle. <laughs> hey, hey, Splat. You weren't really what I was expecting, but you are kind of cool. And you feel interesting, too. See? Splat is cool. Uh, does he bite? Um... Not all the time, just sometimes. What? Coco, no! Oh my goodness, where did he go? My mama's gonna kill you! Me? You're the one who lets that go. I said be gentle. Yeah, that was right before you said that he bites. You know, things like that, you should probably tell people before you let them hold your pet. Hey, 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 hey what is going on in here? Uh, nothing, Mama. Just playing lost and find. Oh, interesting. Well, pipe it down, please. Have fun, but not that much fun. Well, we apologize for being so loud, Miss Streety. Thank you, Trent. Listen, we need to find Flat quick. His name is Flat. Well, he's gonna be Flat if my Mama gets to him and steps on him. So stop whining and start looking. <laughs> Why you had to throw him? He's my best friend. Oh, well that's funny because I thought that I was your best friend. You shouldn't have thrown my okay, friend. you two are at it again. What's the problem? Well, go ahead, Trent. Tell Mama what you did. What I did? What? No, Coco, you know what? Okay, wait, wait, wait. Let's not play the blame game. What is going on? Well, Mrs. Tweety, I brought my pet Splat over. Um, I'm listening. Hello, keep going. What pet? I didn't see you walk in with anything. Mama, listen to me very carefully and don't move. What is happening? Um, I, I don't want you to get scared, but please don't jump, okay? But, but splat is in your hair. I've been looking all over for you. I'm so glad you're okay. That 
was in my hair. Trent, put him away until your mother comes to pick you up. Okay, Miss Sweetie. Uh, can I hold him again? No! Now, now, Coco, you know that's a no-no. Every time we turn our heads, you're always into trouble. With pretty big tails and a smile that makes us giggle. What can we say? That's just Coco being Coco. Now, now, Coco, you know that's a no-no. It's been two years and three months since I've proven that I'm responsible enough to have a puppy. Mama says that it's a lot to handle, but it can't be that bad, right? <laughs> what has you smiling from ear to ear? Oh, nothing. It's clearly something. Well, since you asked, I'm just really proud of myself. These last few years, I've really matured, learned some responsibility, and even learned how to be ready for even more bigger responsibilities. Oh, really? And how's that? Well, to start, I wake up really early. That's to ask me for breakfast. Oh. Well, you know what they say, the early bird gets the worm. Well, I pick up my toys. Um, half your toys, half. The rest you stuff in a corner and act like I don't know. Oh, well, it looks clean when I'm done. I mean, I brush my teeth without you asking. You know, I do have to give you that one. You've been brushing your teeth morning and night. Yeah, then, you know, I will forever since realizing Grammy wears dentures from barely brushing hers. <laughs> Coco, she did. Well, sometimes. Look, she just started getting older. Give Grammy a break. Okay, okay. Well, the main responsibility that I have proven to achieve is growing plenty. He's doing great. I'm pretty sure that plant is dead. No, it's not. Coco, you can't even take care of yourself. Let alone a plant. I'm, I, I, I'm sorry, but this was an A and B conversation, so you could see your way out. Uh, stop it, stop it. That's inappropriate, so stop. Who is teaching you that stuff? They said it at school. Well, don't repeat it, especially to your sister. I, I apologize, Aubrey. It's over. Now wait, let's give Coco a chance. You know, now that I think about it, I haven't even seen that plant around. Well, that's because I was trying to show everybody that I could be responsible and help Planty grow healthy and strong. I gotta see this. <laughs> okay, let's see. <laughs> okay, guys, close your eyes. Okay, let's see. Okay. Mama and Ari, Planty, Planty, Mama and Ari. Coco, you grew that? Yep. I guess she has grown a bit. A lot of it, I've grown so much that I've proven that I'm responsible for even bigger responsibilities. And what's that? What are you saying? Speak up, I can't hear you. No, 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 no. Absolutely not. A dog and a plant are not the same. And then one minute you want the dog and the next you don't. Please, Mama, a doggy will play with me. Ari and Rhea, they're too big now. They never want to play. Here we go with the guest room. I'm serious. Every time I ask them to play, they say they're busy. Well, Coco, I mean, they're just a little older than you, that's all. So I can get a puppy? Yes. Really? Mm-hmm. Yes, a toy puppy. We'll go pick one out at the store. Mm. Now, now, Coco, you know that's a no-no. Every time we turn our heads, you're always into trouble.